My name is Usman Sheikh. I'm the founder and CEO of XIQ. We started about six years ago, 2018. We were one of the first companies to introduce generative AI to B2B sales. And the first thing that we had introduced was the ability to predict the personality of your prospective buyer. And this became quite popular because it helped salespeople overcome that barrier of being able to do research, to find out who the prospects were that they were going to talk to, and gave them ideas and guidelines as to how to drive those conversations in a purposeful manner. Today, fast forward six years, we are here to show you how we can take extremely complex and time-consuming best practices in sales, those that every salesperson and marketer should conduct. We are going to show you how we can streamline them and using generative AI, automate that process. So what used to take you days and weeks to do can now be performed in minutes. And doing that, we give you time back and information and intelligence that you can use to engage more customers in a much more productive and effective fashion. It's important to realize when you're selecting an AI vendor, what is the purpose that And what is the goal and inspiration that that vendor had when they were starting to build out the AI? My background is SAP. I had the pleasure of working many, many years with some of the top salespeople in the industry. And what I got to observe was that only the top 5% of these sellers consistently closed high-value deals. So started looking and investigating what were some of the reasons why they were so much more successful than their peers. And their winning formula, what we discovered, was that they had vast networks of connections that were feeding information to them. And they were helping them understand what the landscape was within the company they were selling to, as well as within the industries. So this intelligence gathering was a intuitive, second nature thing to these top 5% sellers. Second, they had deep industry knowledge. They knew what was happening between the competitors. They knew what was happening within the industry, what the opportunities were, what the challenges were. And using this industry knowledge, they were able to leverage that to provide solutions and become partners to their clients rather than sellers selling a product to their client. And lastly, they were really good and empathetic about building relationships with their prospects. And they understood the minutest details about these individuals. So that was what we were looking at, like how can we take these best practices and make it available to the rest of the company so they can also perform at that top elite level. The challenge with these, with these best practices is these are complex tasks that take a lot of time. Time is money, so it's expensive. And we are all under, all salespeople are under quota pressure. So they're asked to do a certain volume of tasks within a certain time frame, And as a result, these time-consuming best practices are sacrificed and compromised. And as a result, the quality of sales, the quality of outreach goes down. When we started conceiving XIQ as an AI-powered platform for B2B sellers and marketeers, here are four key considerations that went in. First of all, we looked at generative AI to be able to help us simplify those tasks. Second thing, those vast networks of connections and the mastery over their prospects' needs. So we turned to behavioral psychology. We understood that there's a personality assessment methodology. There are quite a few of them. We selected DISC, and we used an AI algorithm to automate the ability to predict the personality. And today, we have millions of profiles looked up every year. We have access to 950 million individual person profile. Next, what we did is we focused on the B2B use cases. And really, that's our pedigree. That's our background. And we went out and we looked at how can we build a platform that is designed to help sellers and marketeers. And lastly, make the user experience so friendly and easy that it can become easily accessible and everybody can adopt that platform, use it with real ease. And that's what we will be showing you today. Let me introduce the platform. What does that translate into into day-to-day -day for you? So first of all, what we looked at in terms of the scope was the full end-to-end -end funnel coverage from prospecting, demand generation, content creation, automating drip campaigns, being able to qualify and understand at a deep level the company and the individuals we are going to be selling to, 
as well as the able to write emails and engage with those individuals. And then finally, wrap it up with the analytics to prioritize who I should be talking to and who I should not be talking to and what I should be talking to. All of this is in one SaaS platform that's accessible. No integration required, simply a subscription, sign up and start using. The reason that we are different from, for example, Copilot or ChatGPT or Gemini is because we are designed for B2B sellers and marketers. What does that mean? So first of all, we access database of 950 million people where we can predict their personality type. This becomes very, very useful when we get into that human exchange, whether that be email, meeting, calls, convincing, negotiating, persuading. We need to know who the person is that's sitting across the table, how we should most effectively speak to them. Secondly, we created a business corpus. Our business corpus has 20 million companies, has about 200,000 sales alerts that are generated a day. Everything you wanted to know about a company is here. And we brought it under one roof, again, to help the seller save time when they're looking up. These, they don't have to jump across to LinkedIn Navigator, corporate websites, Yahoo Finance, um, investor relationship websites. It's all packaged in one location, saves you a lot of time. Third thing that was important to us was to be able to infuse what the customer is saying about their products and services. Bring their voice, their product definitions into the equation. So when we start composing responses or start analyzing situations, we can take into account the strength, weakness, opportunities of the client solution and using their words and their statistics, merge them into the messages that we might be communicating. And to connect all the dots and tie all of this and bring it all together, we have a large language model called Gilroy. You will see this everywhere in XIQ. And simply, this is a conversation model. You ask questions and Gilroy responds by fetching information from those three databases to make it so that salespeople and marketers are not now training to become prompt engineers. We've created prompt libraries. And one of the key areas we're going to show you is how these preset prompts can now be automated so that sellers at a push of a button can execute these complex research, email writing, relationship building kind of tasks in seconds and use that information purposefully with their clients. Mm -hmm.